Listing Diario Editorial for January 26 of 2023. Pedestrians at higher risk. The country has an unwanted record of death and injuries from traffic accidents. And until now, no policy or strategy has been able to resolve that painful sinister equation. That's why the occasional politics and Christmas and Easter operatives, young blood continues to fall on highways and avenues. One of the actions that contributes to preserving the lives of citizens on public roads is the construction and maintenance of pedestrian bridges. If they are in good repair and not taken over by peddlers or criminals, these structures are very useful. But that doesn't seem to be the general rule. Because in addition to being a waste of money to build and neglect their maintenance, such degradation renders them useless. What is the value of a pedestrian abandoned by the authority if a person uses it to avoid being hit by a vehicle but can fall into the void through a huge hole in its extractor? The city has to be friendly with its people and the obligation of the authorities is to keep these works in optimal condition. The pedestrian on the Charles de Gaulle Highway near the Savannah Perdida sector in Santo Domingo Norte has had to be closed because it is dilapidated due to lack of maintenance. As the pedestrian cannot be used, the school children, pregnant women, the elderly, and all kinds of people are obliged to cross the avenue at a trot to avoid being crushed by vehicles. It is urgent, cannot be postponed, and it is in the national interest that President Luis Abinader ordered to give priority to the optimal maintenance of this and all pedestrians because their use allows avoiding the risk of accidental death. For Listing Diario, voiceover and translations by Indira Rodriguez.